This video will show you how to make an admin for your website. Right now there are four different types of admins you can create. Now let's start with the first. It's full admin. The full admin basically has access to everything on your website. So they could delete everything, they can create everything, they can edit everything. Only make this type of admin for users you absolutely trust. To make a full website admin, you'll need to be the owner of the website. So let's go to site admin, users. Here I'm going to make Chris a full admin. Tick on the box, user tools, make administrator. And that's it, he's a full admin. So now if I log in as Chris, I have site admin at the top left hand corner and access to everything. Let's make the second type of admin, panel access admin, which is giving the user access to certain areas of your panel. So let's go to site admin users. And in here we make a new tag. So we'll call it, well, I want to give Chris access to um, admin my modules. So I'll call it module admin, modules admin actually, because he'll admin all the modules. All right, make tag private. And that's good, save. Okay, so we give Chris this tag, tag user, module admins. And now we go to settings. We go to admin panel access. Okay, so you can see here these are the different areas of your admin panel. So user and tags, that will give him the ability to edit user and tags, team management. So I'm going to give him module access. And there's the tag, just select that. And now Chris has access to admin all the modules on the website. Chris now has site admin modules. There you go. Alright, so now let's remove this setting. Now let's make a different type of admin. This admin is a specific module admin. So you're giving admin access to just one module. So I want to give Chris the ability to make news and blogs. So let's go to the news and blog module. And next to the Next to the uh, module title, you'll see admin access, website owner. Let's change that. So click on that. And he's already tagged with website admin, so we just select website admin tag and click off. And that's it. Now Chris has the ability to edit just this module. So now the last and most fine pointed way to create an admin is through each specific module if there is a setting to get. For example, forums. Where's my forums? Forums. Forums you can give moderator rights, which gives the, the moderator ability to edit threads, delete threads, move threads. So let's go with let's go directly in the module itself. And you'll see different categories of the form here. Let's, let's uh, make a moderator for general discussion. So we edit. And you'll see viewing access, posting access, moderation access. Let's set moderation access to modules admin. That's his tag. You can make a new tag if you want, but let's just use this tag for now. Save forum. And now Chris is the moderator for general discussion. So those are the four different ways to create admins for your website. Thanks for watching.